Okay, I'm just squaring everything up here, just trying to get all the draft off of everything that I'll measure it up. This is the steam chest cover for the steam engine. I know I haven't. Yeah, I probably won't be putting out any more videos for a little while. I've got to go out of state and everything else for a few weeks, so I probably won't upload anything for a while. I'll take and get this all squared up here on two sides, that way I can draw out the lines and stuff for to match the steam chest, and I'll come back. Okay, I'm back. Um, I did up the steam chest, just removed that part a little bit there. It really looks off-center because it was rubbing, but it's square. I forgot to click record, so it wasn't anything important. I just fed the tool down. I think this is about a hundred thousandths past depth of cut here, so I think it's about two and a half thousandths step over, so it's not taking very much, it's just take a deep cut. I already scribed the lines on it. There's one going up here and one just below it to run the tool to. I just scribed them with the, the tool. I was out here yesterday working on this and just didn't feel like bringing the camera out. Um, I've been watching Mr. Pete's videos again on threading and I saw the something similar to this and I was like that's pretty simple to make so I got 55 degrees on one side and 60 on the other okay make it a lot easier to make the threading tools since my lathe does now have threading capabilities whenever it gets back from running get you a shot of the lines here. Yeah, I think you can see that now. It's just scribed in there. stuff is so easy to machine, it's not funny, that's why I'm able to take such deep cuts. Also this tool is a piece of cake to use on this stuff. I'll go down to the line on this, and then go over. Then I gotta eat all of this from here to here out. Eat all that away. That's gonna take a while. This thing's almost two times as thick as it's supposed to be because I got tired of patterns not being big enough. I'll machine half the thing away if I have to, but I'll make sure it fits. Yeah, I'll come back when this is whittled away a bit. Okay, last cut. Um, I think I got probably 200,000 steps to cut. I'm just hogging the metal out now. Okay, 
I got it done up. It fits perfectly. Now to get it down to size. I'm deciding whether to leave it the cast cover like the rest of it or machine it. And yeah. I don't know. I may make it cast for now and then if I don't like it when I put the thing together it's not hard to just take a few thousands cut off of it just right off. So I'll clean this up to about to about half inch. And then yeah. I'll go start putting it together, see what it looks like. Just not drilling any holes yet, just clamping it. Finally the last pass. Under all those shavings is the steam chest cover. I took it down about 7 16 7 inch thick. And while this has been working on it, cutting itself, I've been playing with the cutting with the jig for grinding it, and I got a nice 60 degree point tool. Everybody's asking me why am I cutting so much air? Because the stroke center goes. I'll zoom out here. The stroke actually goes towards the center point. So if I can't get it all the way out, if I, I can't be able to get clear back here to cut. That's why. I'll be heading down to Mississippi about a week. I'm getting ready for that. I'm going down to Sule Festival. Sule Steam Festival. So I'll be down there for a few days and then heading to Florida. So you probably won't get any videos until I get back or until I get to a place that actually has Wi-Fi and I probably won't be doing much for video except for the festivals and stuff because I'll be a few hundred miles from my shop if you guys want to come down to Sule Steam Festival I'll be down there Along with a bunch of other metal casters, we have an absolute blast down there every year. So you're more than welcome to come. I think the price of it was like five bucks for admission, that's all. But it's an absolute blast down there. So if anybody comes, I'll see you there. I'll come back when this is done. Take it over to the shop and see how it fits. Okay, I got it all done up here. There's the steam chest cover. 
don't know. I may take a skim cast off just to take a hair off, but I don't know. Thinking about taking this face down a bit more because it's not needed that high. I'll put it about there, I guess. Yeah, that looks okay, I guess. It has plenty of clearance. On the back side now, here it is. There's plenty of clearance there for the gland nut to go in. So, I'd say that's... See what it looks like in the front. It's a little too tall for the steam chest, or a little too wide, but... I think it'll work. It's not going to interfere with anything being that tall, just... Yeah. Okay, I think... I think I'm going to call it for now. It's getting cold out here and... Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to call it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you probably back when the festivals are over or whenever I get to some place to upload the videos for the festivals. Okay, see ya.